To end the channel, we're going to take a look at my friend Toddzilla's Purple EVH Stripe Super Strat. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got something special. We're going to take a look at this purple EVH inspired Super Strat that was built by my buddy Dion Edge in Nashville. Dion is a great builder. He used to work um, for the Gibson Custom Shop. He's now a guitar technician um, and a good friend of mine. And he built this for my other friend, Toddzilla. You've all seen Toddzilla on my videos if you're familiar with this channel. But Toddzilla is a, um, you know, he's an 80s uh, musician just like myself. We grew up in the 80s and to this day we still try to keep the flame burning when it comes to shredding and doing the Van Halen stuff. And <laughs> we just love big rock, man. We love rock, rock and roll. I mean, nothing wrong with that. So, But uh, for Todd's 50th birthday, Dion uh, built him this guitar. And Todd's favorite color is purple. Todd is really in the purple. Todd's a big Prince fan and Todd does a funk band called Jones World. They're really good. He does a Prince tribute band that's fantastic. I'll put the link in the description below, but for Todd's 50th birthday, Dion built this guitar. This is a, um, basically this is supposed to be like the Bumblebee paint job, but it's done in purple with silver stripes and TZ50 instead of 5150. That's for Toddzilla 50. So, you know, Todd's quite a colorful, colorful character, and he's really a cool dude, but if anybody knows Todd, they understand the whole Toddzilla persona. So TZ50 is what Dion put on this. We've got a really nice Floyd Rose, uh, looks like a 1000. This is a Seymour Duncan 78 pickup. I have not plugged this guitar in and played it. We're gonna do a demo shortly after looking at this guitar and give this thing a test. I can't wait to see what the 78 Seymour Duncan sounds like. And uh, on the headstock here, we've got Dion's logo. Does wonderful, wonderful work, man. Dion makes some of the finest uh, Van Halen tribute guitars that I've ever seen. He's made a couple for me, and, and I still have them, and they're fantastic. Let me flip this thing over, and we'll take a look at the back side, okay? Okay, as promised, here's the back of the guitar. Locking nut through the neck as it should be. Wonderful paint job on the back. We got the springs. Dion always autographs and signs his work. We got Dion's autograph there. I like this neck plate. This is a nice personal touch. They call Todd the Atomic Funk. Because Todd loves funk, man. He loves the old Van Halen, and he loves loves a bunch of stuff. But Todd does a lot of funk, and he's just he's just one good, he's a real groovy cat, man. So check him out. All right. So without further ado, let's take a look at this thing in the studio and see what see what it sounds like. Let's plug it in. Awesome. 